Hi, welcome back, and today I'm trying OJ. Um, when I first bought this, I thought it was Orangi Boom. Um, and Orangi Boom are owned by the uh, United Dutch Breweries and brewed in the Netherlands. But as you can see, it says sort of born in Belgium. Or born in Belgium. Uh, and he's sort of owned and brewed by Lickazar. And also, according to Ligazar's website, uh, it stands for, look at, looks at the pad, um, OJ Beer is a new taste experience inspired by one of the world's strongest men, Belgian-born Odo Jost. Or is it Odo Vost? Don't know. Does it really matter? I might do to Mr. Jost, but... Okay. So... 8.5 strong imported beer. What does it taste like? Let's open it up to find out. As I've been reviewing uh, sort of more lager style beers, I've found that I'm enjoying the sort of multi tastes. So I'm hoping I get a big strong multi hit from this one. Okay, so sort of dark amber appearance doesn't appear to be heavily carbonated big multi nose on that okay It's got that slightly sweet, not overly sweet, not a sugary sweet, but a slightly sweet malty taste, which I am associating with stronger beers. There is a taste of alcohol. I mean, the strongest one I've tried to date is the Kestrel 9%. No, I'm lying. I will put a link to that one. It's the Fax 10%. But this one tastes somehow stronger. There's a very subtle bitterness on the back end. That lovely multi sort of biscuity flavour. I am liking this. I'm liking this a lot. So there you go. Now, OJ do a range. Um, I think 8.5 is the baby. Well, no, I think I'm lying. They do a 5% Pilsner. And sort of, then they jump up to 8.5 and upwards. I think the strongest one they do is a 20. Now, I've only seen 8.5 in a tin on the shelf. Um, so, oh, I'm dying to try some of the others, but we'll see if I can get a hold of them. So this is not bad at all. The units are quite interesting. On the back of the can, it's got 4.3 UK units and 3.4 Australian units. So I've always wondered how some of the European countries have a different units to the UK. I always thought that science and a unit of alcohol was standard, you know, science is science and, and that's that but it appears that governments don't think so. So what do I really think of this? It's, re it's I really like that. That is nice. It's a strong beer. I chilled this one down. I think, you know, on the back of the can, it does say best served at three degrees. It's, not it's one to be savoured i think um you wouldn't 
you know, you wouldn't want it on a hot summer's day because if this warmed up, I suspect it would not be very palatable. Okay, there you go. Um, I found this one in an off license in Oswestry um, because we are in Wales and we have a minimum pricing unit and I've just not seen it around. I think possibly because of the high units, um, you know, they might not, uh, you know, shopkeepers might not think they're going to sell many. Um, and I paid about two quid for it. So there you go, OJ. Good, excellent. I shall enjoy this now. Okay, if you're enjoying my name ramblings, and I hope you are, please consider hitting the like and subscribe. Your support's appreciated, and as ever, be good to yourselves.